Local guy turned Hollywood superstar and huge Democratic fundraiser George Clooney is calling for President Biden to drop out of the presidential race. Thanks for joining us at six. I'm Sheree Pellello. And I'm Mike Dardis in a New York Times op-ed piece today. The Kentucky native using some strong words to urge the president to step aside. This comes less than a month after the president was involved in that debate and also recently Clooney hosted that star-studded fundraiser for the president. So in the piece, he wrote that it's devastating to say it, but Joe Biden, the one that I was with three weeks ago at the fundraiser, was not the Joe Biden of 2010, wasn't even the Joe Biden of 2020. He was the same man we all witnessed at that debate a few Thursdays ago. He continued on saying that we are not going to win in November with this president. Obviously, he's a Democrat. On top of that, we will not win the House and we're not going to win the Senate either. The son of a former Cincinnati news anchor, Nick Clooney, ended the story with these words. Joe Biden is a hero. He saved democracy in 2020. We need him to do it again now in 2024. George Clooney also mentioning Ohio in his op-ed, writing that if Biden were to step down, the new nominee would still make the ballot deadline in Ohio. Secretary of State here in Ohio, Frank LaRose, confirming this in a social media post yesterday, saying that Democrats have until September 1st to get a new name on the ballot if President Biden were to step down. So this piece, of course, comes despite the president telling the American people in Congress repeatedly that he still plans to stay in the race. This coming Monday, NBC's Lester Holt sits down with the president one on one. That's also, by the way, the first night of the Republican National Convention. The full unedited interview is going to be airing at nine o'clock in the evening right here on WLWT.